Hey guys, my name is James from gigapress.net. If you've been looking for a way to level up your WordPress website with an eye-catching image slider, you're in the right place. In this video, you'll be learning how to add a beautiful and responsive image slider to your WordPress website. First, I'll show you how to do it without using any plugins, and then later on, I'll guide you through the much easier method using a free plugin. Let's start with the first method, adding an image slider without using any plugin. In the description below, I've added a link to a PHP code. Copy that code first. Simply click this copy button. We're going to use this code to enable a custom shortcode to turn your grouped blocks into a slider. Now go to your WordPress dashboard, navigate to Tools, and select Theme File Editor. Open the functions.php file. But before you make any changes here, it's very important to create a child theme. This helps you keep your custom code safe, even when you update your theme. I also recommend making a backup before editing the functions.php file. If you want to know how to create a child theme, click the link in the description below. Once your child theme is ready, open the functions.php file and paste the code at the bottom and click Update File. Now let's add the actual slider to a page. Open the page where you want the slider. Select the page to open the page editor or site editor if you're using a block theme. Here in the editor, add a cover block to design the first slide. Click the plus icon and search for the cover block. This block lets you add an image background with text, perfect for a slide. To add an image to this block, you can upload from your computer or choose from your media library. Once done, select the image and find the overlay section. If you don't need the overlay, set this to zero. Then add your desired text to the slide. You can change the color or customize the text in the typography section. Once done, duplicate this cover block to create the next slide. Again, same process. Click the image to replace it. Then you can also change the title and customize the text for each slide you want to add. You can add as many slides as you like. Once you're done creating your slides, click the overview icon or the list icon on the top toolbar, and then group these slides together. Hold down the shift key and click each slide to select them all. Then right click and choose group. Now on the right panel, click the advanced section. Here we assign the slider class to this group. Publish the page and see the result. As you can see, the blocks are placed below each other but by adding shortcodes, we turn these blocks into sliders. Click the plus icon to add a new block, search for shortcode, and select it. Then type this code, slider, source equals slider, height equals 550 pixels. Click save and preview your page. Finally, you have the image slider in your WordPress website. All right, so that's how you can build a basic image slider in WordPress without any plugins. But if you're looking for something more advanced, more dynamic, and way easier to manage, especially if you're not comfortable editing code and you're just a beginner, then this next method is for you. This time, we're going to use a free plugin called Smart Slider 3. In my opinion, this plugin is one of the most powerful and easy to use slider plugins out there for WordPress. From basic image sliders to video showcases and dynamic post sliders, Smart Slider 3 offers the flexibility to handle it all without writing a single line of code. It's fully responsive, SEO optimized, and works with any WordPress theme. And if you are a beginner, this plugin is best for you. So let's start with installing the Smart Slider plugin. Go to your WordPress dashboard. On the left-hand menu, navigate to Plugins and select Add Plugin. Now in the search bar, just type Smart Slider 3, and it should be the first one that pops up. Go ahead and click Install Now, and then activate once it's ready. Once installed, you'll see a new option on your sidebar called Smart Slider. Click that, and you'll land on this page. Then click Go to Dashboard. Now, click the big green button to start a new project. Here you have an option to create a new project from scratch or start with a template. If you choose Start with a Template, here you can find hundreds of pre-made templates. Some are free, but some require the pro version. If you want to preview the template, click the eye icon. Then it will show how the slider will look. If you scroll down, 
You will also see guides on how to customize this template or manage the design or layout. If you're okay with this one, click the Import button. Next, here you can customize the slider. You can change the size, controls, animations, or enable the autoplay. To change the image display, click on the Edit button. Here, you can upload an image from your computer or select from your media library, then click Save. Once your slider is ready, it's time to add it to your site. Go to your site editor, click the plus icon at the top left, then drag and drop this smart slider block to your site. Now, select the slider you want to insert, and then click on the Insert button. Click the Save button at the top right, and then click this icon and select View Site. As you can see, the image slider is now functional on the website. But if your slider doesn't stretch all the way across the page, just go back to the site editor, click the slider, and click Edit. Go to Size, then go to Layout, and select Full Width. Click Save at the top right. On your site editor, delete the old block and then add the updated one. Your slider should now be full width and fully responsive. If you want to create an image slider from scratch, you can select Create a new project. Then select Slider as your project type. You need to upgrade to Pro to use the carousel and showcase sliders, so in this case, I'll be using this simple slider. Then name it and enter the width and height and select the layout. Then click Create. Now you can add your images. Just select these cards to upload or add images from your media library. You can also add a post, static overlay, or dynamic slides. Once you're done, go back to your editor and add the smart slider block to your page. And that's it! You now know the simple ways on how to add an image slider to your WordPress website. One with custom codes, and the easier one, using the Smart Slider 3 plugin. For more WordPress tutorials, our free WordPress Masterclass, and fast and reliable web hosting, visit gigapress.net. Thank you, and see you next time.